Hello there, welcome to my channel. Change is a very constant in life. Change is constant. And at Meta or at, on Facebook advertising, there has been different kind of changes that has been coming up here and there. So recently, Meta has announced about the changes to the way we target our audiences, to the audience targeting. Now, these changes to an extent affect advertising if you do not know, right? So if you're not aware of these changes, it's it is likely to affect the results you get from your adverts so i'm in this video i'm going to show you these changes and just a little tip on how you can um position your adverts to give you better results as a result of these uh, changes which no one expected so soon yeah so let's take for instance that you want to you know run a sales campaign to um say to your instagram okay let's run a sales campaign to instagram by the way, please make sure you like this video so that more people get to see my video on YouTube. All right, so we're going to the ad set. Now, the change is at the ad set level where you target your audience. Okay, so we select where we are, uh, where we are going to. This is messaging apps. We are sending our traffic to messaging apps. And then um, we select the business page, of course. Okay, so let's change the page here. The normal way you run adverts, yeah, just the normal way you set up your advert, select your page, whatever that is. I take this for instance. I uncheck Messenger. I uncheck WhatsApp because we want to run it on Instagram. Mm -hmm. And we come down. Put your budget as usual. You know what your budget should be. You include a budget there. And then we come to location targeting. This is the point where the changes has been has, has taken place. For now, more changes are going to be rolled out in the coming months, especially at the advantage plus targeting area of the ads manager. But here at the asset level, let's look at location targeting. Okay. Let's take, for instance, this is Nigeria. I want to target in Nigeria, I want to target a place like Lagos, for instance. So I put Lagos here. Lagos here. And I select the um, city. And then I want to target people within 25 mile radius of Lagos City. All right. So usually you have the option to use this drop down button here. So these are the things that are here. Okay. This drop down button, you can target people living in this location. Okay, now when you target this one, this second option, your advert is going to be shown to only those living, living within the particular location where you want to target or you want to sell to. If you're a small business owner, um, you know, a small business who sells within a, a, a locality, like a restaurant, like jewelry, jewelry store, any business at all that targets within a specific location and you want to target people who live there because they are your customers, this is the one you're going to use here right before this was the one we used to use all right now if you want to target people who were recently in this location for instance you are a business based in dubai um anywhere egypt morocco wherever it is but you know because you're you you live in a in a center of tourism you live in a place that attracts tourists so much and people will be recently visited your location you can show them the, the your ads even when they have gone back to their states or to their locations now you can make them an offer on their next visit stuff like that it works for especially for tourist attraction centers okay now this last one is for people traveling in this location okay facebook says people whose most recent location is within the selected area but whose home is more than 125 or 200 kilometers away so ideally, as a small business owner, the second option is the one you choose. Okay? The second option is the one you choose and you start running your advert. But now Meta is letting us know that they are taking away this second option here. Actually, if you check your ad account, yours might not be there anymore. Okay? But in this particular ad account of mine, I still have it. Because they are rolling it off. They are taking it off gradually. It's a face-by-face -face stuff. But they have made the announcement. Some of my ad accounts do not have it anymore. 
your own might still have it for now and it might not have it so it's it's a 50 50 chance but be assured that within now and the next one month or a few weeks it is completely gone what meta is telling us now is that this is the only option available people living or recently in this location meta is letting us know that the only option available now is people living or recently in this location okay so you can no longer target only people living in this location but people living or recently in this location so this is a kind of a little problem a little challenge for small businesses because you are trying to target people in your location but then someone in far away in far away country is seeing your advert because they were recently in that location for instance if you are selling if you are trying to sell something within lagos or within accra ghana let's use ghana for, for example if you live in accra and they, you are a small business in accra and you want to sell your products to people within accra what this means is that with this update your advert is going to be shown to both people in accra and everyone who was in accra recently now they might have gone back to new york to the uk to nigeria to morocco to Abu Dhabi, wherever they might have gone back to different parts of the world, but they will still be seeing your advert and they cannot make a purchase. So it's like money wasted, yeah? That is what this update is about. So your advert is going to be shown to both those living in Accra and those who were recently in Accra but probably are not there anymore. So for instance, you live in Lagos, you run advert, and somebody is telling you, okay, I'm in Port Harcourt, I need it today. And you are like, no, I'm in Lagos. We can't send it today. That's your money going. That's your money wasting. That's what this update is about. But there is a way that you can curtail this to bring about a, a slight solution for your business, which is using the dog whistle advertising style. You have to use the dog whistle advertising style in marketing or in copywriting we call it dog whistle so in this case you have to call out your audience call out those who you are trying to sell to if you have a restaurant in accra you call out people living in accra in your advert you write it out in the ad copy on your video you make it clear that this is people these are the people you are selling to if you're in lagos your business is in lagos you can say Hey, free delivery to Lagos residents only. You make it clear so that if I see the advert, and probably I was in Accra recently and I'm gone, and I know that, oh, this is for only those in Accra at the moment, so I cannot purchase this. So it saves you the stress of trying to go through all the customers who are making inquiries. At the end of the day, only just a few of them are available to pick up because the rest of them are not in town so in this kind of situation the best thing to do is to call out the audience call out the audience you want to serve if you're in abuja call out those in abuja if your ad if your services is for is for travel agents 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 in lagos write it out on your ad copy hello travel agents in lagos If your service is for dog dog owners in Lagos, write it out, hello, dog owners in Lagos. So that any dog owner in Abuja who was recently in Lagos will not be bothered about the adverts. Because you did not call them out. It, you, are, you specifically made it clear that this product or this service or this advert is addressing only dog owners in Lagos. This advert is addressing only event vendors in Benin. This advert is addressing only photo booths in Canada, in Ohio, in New York, in, U in the UK, uh, in London. Do you get me? So you make it clear. You call out your audience, dog whistle. If you are selling to only cake vendors, you call out cake vendors. Makes it easier for you to sell. I hope that you don't get confused when you come to this point and see this new update. More updates are, are rolling out soon and I'm going to be making videos to share all of this information with you. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you share it. If you have any questions, if you have any concern, 
I'm happy to attend and answer you in the comment section. So leave your questions in the comment section and I'll be happy to answer you right there. Okay. And if you'd like to learn more about advertising on Facebook and Instagram, about how to run ads that will bring great sales for your business, how to run ads that will attract the right set of people who will buy from you and move your business to a greater level. I have a course on Facebook and Instagram ads. It's a course on Facebook and Instagram ads and marketing. It's a video course, a step-by-step -step video guide that will show you how to set up structure and deliver effective ads that will only bring in the right set of people, close sales and make more money for your business. So I will leave the link to the course in the description below, or you can simply visit getprimecourses.com forward slash pfam and then you can get the course this is it a complete facebook and instagram ad structure and formula that i use to generate seven figure sales monthly okay so visit i will leave the link to this course in the video description below okay so go to getprimecourses.com forward slash pfam forward slash pfam get that course um and join us in the support group because for this course we have a support group okay we have a support group where you can always get help, ask questions, get help. Whenever you run into any issues on advertising and marketing, you don't have to start looking for where to get help. Just come to the support group there, ask us questions, and myself and every other expert there will be happy to attend to you and give you answers free of charge without paying any extra dime. Okay? So make sure you visit this the website, getprimecourses.com forward slash pfam and get this course, the Profitable Facebook Ads and Marketing Guide, okay? It's a video program that contains tested and proven fast-selling Facebook and Instagram ad strategies, formulas, and a complete framework that can help you attract interested customers, generate quality leads, increase sales, and enjoy a more profitable business. This works for all businesses, from real estate to small business to whatever you do. As far as you use Instagram or Facebook adverts, to attract customers and make sales this course will be helpful to you okay so no more payment issues you get qualified leads you attract interested buyers you run ads that actually convert into sales you enjoy a more profitable business and then you enjoy active 247 support in the support group okay so make sure you get this course um and then join us in support group and enjoy um enjoy good profitable business if you have any questions i'll be happy to answer and thank you for watching this video i'll see you in my next video cheers